The first thing I did when introducing generative AI into my teaching was to show how I use large language models in my academic and professional work. Not so much how I use them, but for what purpose. I modeled how I summarized survey findings using Claude and mocked up a draft of a lesson plan in ChatGPT and used an AI agent to create a rubric for an assignment. And then in the class session, in small groups, we used the AI sandbox to redesign one of our earlier class sessions using different pedagogical approaches. As you can see in this dialogue, I provided a written lesson plan of a class session and students uploaded it to the sandbox. I then provided some prompts based on course concepts to get them started. For example, here I asked Claude to make the activity more authentic. Students went on to apply additional course concepts to modify the lesson plan for different contexts and goals. Now, it was important that they worked with a subject area they knew well to help them investigate the accuracy of the model's responses. The goal of this exercise was to show students how AI tools can be a thought partner alongside a human. Throughout the course, we talk about the fact that having a toolkit is only one piece of what it means to be a professional. You also need to know when to use which tool to solve the problem in front of you. 